Today here on Blue Shift Ministries, we are going to talk about communion and we're going to have communion right now. So everyone get your little bread and get your wine ready and here we go. Heavenly Father, how deeply grateful I am for this beautiful sacrament of communion given to us by the blood of Jesus Christ and David the night before his crucifixion. I commit myself now to partake of this sacrament more often as a powerful way of proclaiming your death, remembering you, anticipating your return, recognizing your body, participating in your death and resurrection, sharing with all believers and separating myself from worldly pursuits. Thank you that as I partake, I am receiving life from you and celebrating the eternal life you have brought to me. I come out of darkness now into the light. I repent for my sins and attitudes. And it's very important to add to this, to repent for the sins and attitudes of your bloodline. That's very important. I ask for forgiveness through the blood of Jesus Christ and David's sacrifice on the cross for me. In the name of the blood of Jesus Christ and David's name, I forgive all those who have hurt me. And I declare my trust in you and your plans for my life. I prepare my heart now to meet you at every opportunity I will have to partake of this wonderful sacrament of Holy Communion. Amen. Praise Jesus. It's very important to take communion and to take communion every day. Have communion with your family. Have communion with your friends. But most importantly, have communion with Father. Communion is expressing to Father that you are a sinner and we must repent for our sins. Father shines on those who repent. Father exalts on those who repent. And Father will always and forever remember those who repent. That is why we take communion to always put Father in remembrance. Believe in Jesus always. Amen.